Hey cute people and happy Mother's Day. The sun is coming out again because it was a dreary day. Dreary sun, dreary sun. But listen, as you can see, this is a whole Bath and Body Works. I wanted to do this video on Friday, but I was so busy running around these North Carolina streets. Or should I say North Carolina roads? When I got home Friday, I was like, it is a wrap. I'm tired. I put it off until today. So while I'm here, I am. Now I'm going to move through this rather quickly because I don't want it to be a very long video. But I do have quite a few things to show you and probably even more things to say. But I do want to share with you something that I hauled a couple of weeks ago. The bag was so small. As usual, I put it down somewhere and then I forgot and... I figured I'd show it down. But anyway, as you know, if you watched the last haul that I've done from Bath & Body Works, which is the only one I think, I may have an old one on my channel, but this one here, I mentioned to you that I was fast becoming in love with their wallflowers. So I got quite a few, a big old bag too at that, and I want to get a whole bunch more. But I got this here because I, was, I, I thought it was really pretty, this um, plug. And as you can see, this really pretty pink. I hope the pink comes through, but that's why I got it. I wanted to get the um, leaf and the pineapple, but those are no longer available, so I'm a lot disappointed. These go for $12.50, so I wasn't going to get them all at the same time, even though I had the 20% off coupon. I figured I'd get this one now, get another one the next time, and so forth, but they're not available. But if you have a leaf and uh, pineapple you don't want, you can always pass them off to me because I sure will take them. They were so pretty. And then I picked this up too because I smelled it. I believe in the store. I'm not really sure if it was in the store where I smelled it the first time or if I got it the first time I smelled it. I don't remember but it was smelling so good I had to get this one. And this one is Waikiki Beach Coconut. And the notes in this one is tropical white coconut salt water breezes and sun bleached woods so i picked this one up here and i cannot wait to plug it in hopefully i'll get a chance to do that really soon and i had a coupon where you would spend i believe it's either ten dollars or fourteen dollars and you get a free gift so i picked this i don't remember if the only free gift they were given were the hand creams but i picked this one because i have the candle and i like the candle so i got the hand cream and these go regular price dollars so I picked those things up I bought it home put it in the corner of my bedroom and forgot that I had it there so now I went to bed in see Bath and Body Works on Friday and I picked up some stuff and I got quite a bit of stuff so I'm gonna move through it really quickly and while I was at the register I saw a guy he was you know paying for his stuff and they gave him this bag and I nearly lost my mind I was like oh my goodness oh my goodness I am ready I am ready yes I am I know you are too so I got two of these big bags and I'm gonna push through it really really quick one thing I got um some stuff for my mom because she's hard to buy for she doesn't like anything so I figured I'd get her some candles because when I buy candles, she always says she likes them. So I got her these two. This one here says, love you. Isn't that pretty? And this um, cellophane paper and the um, ribbon you get for free. But I got this one for her. I believe they had three with the white jar. Different flowers, of course, and different scents. But I got love you. And this one here is fresh cut lilacs. And this is Lilac Bouquet, Dewy Greens, and Soft Spring Air. And I thought that was really pretty. Tell me it's not pretty for a gift. So I got that. And then I also picked this one up for her too. This one here says, Mom, you're amazing. And she is. So I got this one for her. And this is a fragrance that I've burned before. This is Watermelon Lemonade. It's Watermelon Ice sparkling water and mayor lemon so i got that and as you know they always have something so cute to make you spend extra money these little accessories so i got this butterfly here i believe they had it in yellow i saw the yellow which didn't do anything for me when i saw this i like perfect look 
put it right on the lid it's really really cute it really be nice if you can put it on the actual candle so when you burn it it's still there but it goes on the lid and then when you take the lid off you don't see it but it's really pretty for decoration and i put this purpose for my mama and the sale that was going on at that time was buy two get two for free so i figured hey why not and then i had the coupon get ten dollars off for forty dollars i believe it was so you know I had to get something for myself, and I did. I picked this one up. This is the first one that I smelled, because I didn't really want to take a lot of time smelling a lot of different things, because they have so many new things, were new to me. But I saw this and I liked it. Anytime I see anything with linen, I'm on it. So I got this one here, linen and lavender. And I like the blue jar. Yes, really, really pretty, right? And I like the fact, too, that the top doesn't have white bar on it or Bath and Body Works. It's just a really cute lid. And this one here is crisp linen, lavender sea salt, and fresh breeze. So, yes. It smells so good. And I'm going to tell you, I don't know what lavender sea salt smells like, but that's what this candle smells like to me if I smell anything. is a lavender sea salt in the fresh breeze. And it's so... Oh, it smells good. I can't wait to burn this one. I think I'm going to burn this one later on this evening. And then I also picked this one up. I asked the young lady for a recommendation. This is one of the ones that she recommended because the first one, I said, I have something so similar. Give me something else. She said, this one here is one that she burns in her new house. And this is Midnight Blue Citrus, as you can see. And I like the pretty jar. I think it's really, really pretty. See what I was saying about the white barn on the top? Okay. So this one here, the notes are Juicy Citrus fresh spring water, and sweet mango. So let me smell it. Mmm, it smells so good. And what can I pick up out of here? Maybe the juicy citrus and the sweet mango. Mmm. Mmm. Because I like scents that smell like it just came out of a laundry mat, Fresh and clean. Or it's something where you just got out of the shower fresh and clean that's the things that I like so I'm going to show you something else I got because they also had a special when you spend $30 you get this for $30 full of stuff this old big old tote bag I don't like the tote bag it feels really good you know it shouldn't just well the whole thing comes out to be $117 for what's inside the bag i don't know if you'll be able to see that can you see that 117 dollars for all the stuff that came with it like eight pieces i'm going to show you real quick but this is a really nice bag i wish it came in other colors than silver but it's it'll make a great weekend bag but this is something that you'll find i think the make of it the way it feels like you should be able to find this in city trends for 12.99 yes i'm gonna tell the truth but it's a great weekend bag. It's really big. I don't think you'll be carrying it as a purse. And then inside that bag came this box full of goodies. And I just wanted to show this to you. VIP. Yeah. So this is the box that came inside the bag. And in this box came eight different things. So I'm going to show them to you really, really quickly. Because again, I don't want this video to be too long. One of the first things that I pulled out of the box was this Gingham Fragrance Mist. Yes, and I smelt it. At first, I wasn't too impressed, but it smells really, really good. I really like this. So this is something else I may give to my mom because it's really hard for me to pick things for her because she's not into anything like she used to be. You know, my mother, I call her the, 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 the original international fly girl, but she doesn't dress like she used to anymore. You know, she's not interested in clothes like she used to be. Like she mentioned, she'll buy them, but she won't wear them, so she doesn't buy them. So why would I buy them for her as a gift? Let me know down in the um, comment section something that you buy for your mom, especially if she's hard to purchase for, like things that you know she used to like, she's not into anymore. And it's like, okay, like she doesn't read anymore, so I can't buy her books. She's not really into the type of jewelry that I like. She has 14 karat gold jewelry she wears all the time and have been wearing for years. And I keep figuring, why would I buy her more? To add on to what she really has, already has, and she's not really going to wear. Because I bought her earrings, 14 carats. She doesn't even wear them. I bought her a watch. She doesn't wear it. But if your mother's like mine, where a lot of things that you know she used to be into, she's not into anymore. Because she's an older lady. 
And every time you say you want to get her something, she always says, you don't have to give me anything, but you still want to get her something. That's why I bought the candles because they're more of a token of love. Like I'm thinking about you on this Mother's Day. That's what that is for because I just wanted to get her something. But anyway, if that's you, in the comment section, what you do for your mother. Maybe not what you do for her, but what you would buy her for Mother's Day, Christmas, and her birthday. Yeah. But anyway, okay. So this here is the body cream. So remember, I got all this stuff now for $30, so it wasn't too bad. And I think she may use the body cream. But this, the body cream, for some reason, I would definitely use as opposed to the fragrance mist, which it does smell good. Now, the notes here are white peach, fresh clementine, violet and clean musk, and blue freesia. That's what's in here. And it smells good. Mm-hmm. And another thing they have in the box. Now, I smelled this one. Yeah, I didn't spray it. I smelled it. But when I smelled it, to me, I just smelled a whole bunch of alcohol. Yeah. This is In the Stars. This is another fragrance mist. They give you a cute little travel size um, bottle. I guess it's, yeah, three ounces. I think you could travel with this, like, on a plane. But the um, packaging is really, really cute. Can you see it with the little stars on it? I thought that was really cute. And like I said, I smelled it, but I couldn't get past the alcohol smell. And then another thing in that particular set is another hand cream. This is roses. The packaging is gorgeous. Gorgeous, the packaging it is. Let me see what it smells like if I can. Like roses. I don't really buy a lot of um, body care from bed, bath, and body works. But I figured I'll... Try it. I, I mean, years ago, I did try their fragrance mist. And years ago, I used to buy a lot of their hand lotions and stuff, but I had stopped. And then this here is something that you know, if you know me and my family, we into hand soaps. Get into it. You got to wash your hands after, before you cook, before and after you eat. Um, it, the list goes on. And definitely after you use the bathroom. But I think this bottle is so cute. And I know they have a lot of sales of their hand soaps. But I do not buy them no matter what price. Because I can't see spending $6.50. Which is the regular price. Or then whatever it may be on sale. You get 6 for, I don't know, $20. Nope. Buy them for $0.98 cent at Dollar General. A dollar at um, Dollar Tree. But anyway. The notes in this one. That's soft rose petals. Rain Kissed Ivy and Spring Musk. I was trying to untwist it before, but it was so hard to untwist, I couldn't do it. I wanted to smell it, but the packaging alone is gorgeous. And I got it as part of that set, so I will be using it. Something else that they put in there I thought was really cute. I don't know if this is the name of a scent or not, but this is their antibacterial, antibacterial hand gel. And it's called Don't Quit Your Daydream. I thought this was really, really cute. And if you can see, it has little specks in it. I'm not really into hand gels, the antibacterial hand gels, because I really don't think they do much for you. I think if your hands are dirty, you need to just wash it with some soap and water. But I thought this was really cute. Then they gave the little holder to put your little um, gel in, which I thought was really cute. So, yeah. I don't know how I would use this or... Yeah, but I think I would use it and I like the fact that I think you can adjust this little thing here can you yeah okay pull it on through you can make it tighter if you like but I thought that was really cute now another thing they had which when I was looking at it the young lady I asked her can you pick your candle she said no but if if you buy it and then a couple of days later if you want you can bring it in and say hey you want to change it I believe some places would at least at least she made it seem like they would. But the jar, I mean, look at the, look at this jar. These jars are, are, like, gorgeous. This is so pretty. Look at the black lid. But, of course, it says back the body works on it. But the black lid with the black label and the beautiful flowers and the peach color. I mean, just, you don't even want to burn some of these candles. Just have them sitting around for decoration. Oh. Oh, it smells good. Yes, it does. Okay. This is called Georgia Peach, and it has juicy peaches, dew-covered leaves, and a hint of vanilla. So, of course, I smell peaches. Mm-hmm. Do I smell anything else? Mm, I can't say I smell leaves, but I definitely smell peaches and maybe a little hint of vanilla. But either way, it smells good and it looks good. 
Okay, so that's all that I got, and I wanted to get through that really quickly because, like I said, I don't want to keep you guys forever, but then I want to show you this. Bad owl. Yes, honey, look, I got two of them. Yes, and honey, they hold these close to the chest. They are behind the register, honey, so you can't even just pick them up. Nobody. You have to make a purchase, I believe, to get them. Maybe you could walk in the store and say, can I have? I don't know. Try it. If you get them, let me know. Because I don't want to have to purchase something to get more of these things. I don't think I want to spend a lot of money when the um, semi-annual sale comes. I may just buy a couple of things. Wallflowers. You know it. And maybe another candle for my mama. You know, start getting her um, a little collection going but um as you can see it starts does it have the date yeah june 10th is when it starts 75 percent of a clear clearance items i believe it ends on july 7th so you have almost a whole month to get your stuff together i'll get ten dollars off of any 40 dollar purchase and i'm ready y'all so listen that's my haul from bath and body works and I am going to end this video now because it's Sunday, Mother's Day, need I say more. I have some things I want to do as far as self-care, like these nails, which I haven't done in months. And something to my feet. Yeah, and get this stuff to my mother and give her a kiss for Mother's Day. Yeah. But listen, guys, I am going to end the video, like I mentioned, to get some things done, put all the stuff away, burn a candle while I'm relaxing. Um, it's really still light outside so maybe i'll go outside for a little while and just chill but either way i just want to say thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching my video stopping by to the channel hopefully you will subscribe and i want to say to you guys to do nothing in this world today or any other day but share and spread love